OSPF has a rule. Every router must be connected with area zero, that is backbone area, to form the neighborship and to exchange the route. But due to network design, always it is not possible for all the routers belonging to other area get directly connected with area zero. That's why here we use one concept called as a virtual link that is going to form a virtual tunnel between non-backbone area and the backbone area. Imagine a situation where we have router one, two, three, and four. So between router one and two, we have area zero. Between router two and three, we have area one. And between router three and four, we have area two. Now, in this case, as router four is completely in area two, that's why it cannot have any direct connectivity with area zero router. For that, we need to form a virtual link and this virtual link will be formed in area one that is having a connectivity in area two as well as in area zero. With the help of this virtual link, we can form a virtual tunnel and we can increase the limit of area zero towards non-backbone area. And with this non-backbone area router can form a neighborship with a backbone area routers and can exchange the routes.